Hi guys, my name is Jasmine. Um, I'm going to talk to you about a few things throughout high school, some things that I learned. And so let's get started. So friendship. I know when you're a freshman, you're going to you're gonna talk a lot, you're going to talk to a lot of people, you're going to think, oh, you know, I have so many friends. You're going to think you're like this. You're going to think you're like this. And when you go to senior year, you might lose some of those friends. You might end up with, I don't know, let's say, you might end up with three. I don't know, maybe, you know? But that's okay because some of them weren't meant to be in your life, some of them weren't meant to stay. Don't stress yourself out because you think you don't have any friends. It's not something that's super huge, it's not something that you should worry about. So if somebody's not your friend anymore, let it go. Move on. You see that person in the hallway, that's okay. Don't reminisce. Don't talk stuff. Just let it go. Whatever happened, happened. Uh, social media. So I know how we all like to watch TV and we all like to be in the now, some of us. And we all focus on what's happening with Miley Cyrus or. Oh my gosh, did you see what Solange did to Jay-Z and Beyonce just stood there? Don't worry about it, it's not important. And I know Beyonce, she made a song called Pretty Hurt. And if you guys haven't heard it, go check it out because it is a good song. It's, it has a deep meaning to it. Um, basically in the song she talks about how she tries to make herself perfect because of what she hears and reads in one quote she says in one part she says blonder hair bigger chest TV says bigger is better soft speech sugar free folk says thinner is better or something like that and it's basically saying that She's trying to stress herself out over trying to be perfectionist. Nobody is, nobody ever will be. So don't worry about it. Academic performance. <laughs> so, my grades aren't the best, and I know that. But as long as you know that you're giving it your all and you're trying your hardest, that's what matters. I know I've gone through high school barely making it. That's okay. You know, just as long as you know, hey, you know, I gave it my all, I did what I had to, I did what I could do, then you'll be fine. Getting involved in high school, get involved in high school, it is so fun. Just, it's fun. I know, for me, I had, there was a sport, there was a enrichment, sorry. There was an enrichment I did during junior year. It was called Bags on Board. Hopefully... One of you guys, if you know what it is, you can restart it, fun, get involved in it. Um, and during my junior, I um, I had an enrichment almost every day, and I enjoyed it. Freshman, junior year, I had soccer. I had soccer too. Freshman year, I barely knew what I was doing. I was like, yeah, let's go, get on the field, yeah. And then when the time came, I had no idea what I'm doing. Why? What do, what do I do here? Okay, where am I supposed to go? What do I do? That was me. And then, um, it wasn't until junior year that I started going once, um, I started going onto the field and getting so aggressive. I literally not so were a girl. <laughs> but um it was fun, you know, I had fun doing what I did. I had fun playing soccer and what they say about what you put into 
practice is what you're putting on the field. It's not it's really not because I used to be lazy at not at some practice. I was I don't wanna do it. And yet I still give my all during the game. How is preparation? So make sure you're I know they say GPA is everything so is ACT ACT scores. Not. Don't stress yourself out over finding a college that's right for your GPA or your ACT score because there's so many colleges that don't make ACT scores or GPAs mandatory. I know my school doesn't. They say it's it's not required but it's recommended. So is ACT scores. And that's how I found my college. I know I want to go there. I I've applied for housing. I've did everything. I got orientation going. And so this is my school, Angelo State University in Texas. Yes, I'm going to Texas. Um, there are teachers or there are people that are like, well, shouldn't you go visit the college first? How do you even know that you're gonna like it? What if you don't? Blah blah blah. Don't listen to them. Don't do what you want to do. It's your life, not theirs. I mean, yes, they are trying to help you, but guess what? If you want to go, if you, because for me, I feel like I've seen all of Illinois. I feel like I've seen what Illinois has to offer me, and I want to go. I want to experience something new. So go. And these are my friends. This was taken at prom. I know it looks funny. Go to prom. It's so fun. Well, I'll see you guys later. Good luck with high school.